All right, back again, YouTube. All right, what do we have here? Yes, another rifle. Hey, this is a Marlin 795. This is my $80 rifle. Yes, that's right, I said $80. Because when I was up in station in North Carolina, well, with military discount and the Christmas deal that they had one year, uh, it knocked this thing brand new down to 80 bucks for me. So I couldn't help but invest in it. And on here we have a center point three to nine bar 32. It is a mil dot scope with illuminated reticle. We are looking at, which I think now the battery's gonna be dead. I just realized that was left on. Nice. Anyways, red, green, illumination, whichever your choice is, adjustable levels. And then I have light and laser with pressure switches. That's right. This thing is awesome. Winchester bipod. Steady it's your shot out, of course. And this thing is good for small game, plinking. Can't tell you how many squirrels I've shot with this thing. It's been great. Also shot a couple of possums, a raccoon or two. Uh, it, it just does a wonderful job. It has the iron sights uh, if I ever wanted them, but the scope has been more than reliable. You can key hole shots with this thing at 100 yards easy real easy so today uh earlier today i was out here doing a little shooting video which it's probably going to take longer to upload that than it is to do this one so you'll probably see this one before that but i'm going to fire 40 grain velocitors out of this thing now earlier in that shooting video i shot some water jugs now, I've got three water jugs over here, because, and they're all lined up. I'm going to shoot them from an angle about right here, but way further back. Mainly because I want to try to catch the bullet. In that video, you see two bullets that I caught in one water jug, but it was fired out of an SR-22 pistol. It was actually pretty cool, because one bullet hit the other one, and you can put them together to see the perfect indentions where it fits. So... I thought it was pretty awesome so what I'm gonna do is over my little flatbed trailer here um, I'm gonna set this little camera up so that y'all can see the water jug explode and then we're gonna see if we can recover the bullet fired from my Marlin 795 yes the 795 takes these little 10 round magazines stock the 10 round metal magazines that Marlin makes are 100% reliable as long as you do not alter them that's right don't alter them also pro mag for this puts out a very good 25 round magazine. let's get this set up right that 25 round magazine is supposed to be really good um, I haven't tried one yet just because I've been putting my money into uh, my AR-15 uh, some other guns that I have around the house some of which you saw in my other video so, I got you set up now to where you can see the jugs. Let me step back and take the shot. Safety's back on. We got bubbles. Bubbles, folks. Uh-oh. I think it had enough velocity. I do not think we caught that bullet. Yep. We did not catch that bullet. Well... Let's take a look at what it did, though. So, split that one nicely. Look at the paper on that. Pop 
pops right through that one. Well, out in this, I don't think there's going to be any fun in that unless I got a metal detector, which I don't have. So, <laughs> let's just blow this shit up. I'm just going to dump the rest of the rounds into it. <laughs> <laughs> 